Bravo honcho Andy Cohen admits that the housewife hiring process needs a little sprucing up. Everything is a work in progress, the Watch What Happens Live host told reporters at the Music Man Broadway opening on Thursday. Bravo has continued to receive backlash over their casting process after Real Housewives of Salt Lake City star Jenny Nguyen was fired last month for a series of controversial Facebook posts that resurfaced from 2020. Nguyen shared memes and photos mocking the Black Lives Matter movement, with some including phrases like BLM thugs and violent gangs. After calls for the businesswoman to be fired, Bravo announced her departure. Bravo has ceased filming with Jenny Nguyen and she will no longer be a cast member on The Real Housewives of Salt Lake City, Bravo said in a statement. We recognize we failed to take appropriate action once her offensive social media posts were brought to our attention. Moving forward, we will work to improve our processes to ensure we make better informed and more thoughtful casting decisions. Nguyen was a Salt Lake City housewife before being fired. NBCU Photobank via Getty Images Unfortunately, Nguyen isn't the only Bravo celeb to have a controversial past. Last year, Jen Shaw, another Salt Lake City housewife, was arrested for allegedly running a telemarketing scheme that ripped off thousands of people. She pled not guilty, but lost her bid to have the case dismissed in December 2021. Shaw's case is still ongoing and she's still on the Bravo series. Former Southern Charm star Thomas Ravenel was fired in 2018, the same day he was arrested on assault and battery charges against his children's former nanny stemming from an incident in 2015. He pleaded guilty in 2019 and was sentenced to a 30-day suspended sentence and $500 fine. On a lighter note, Cohen was thrilled to be seeing Music Man, starring Hugh Jackman and Sutton Foster on Thursday. It means Broadway's back and everything is positive, he said. Cohen was delighted to receive a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. NBCU Photobank via Getty Images He recently returned from a quick trip to LA where he was honored with a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame, which was attended by his parents, sister and son, Ben, 3. I was so excited, he said. They told me I was getting it in 2019. It got put off and put off because of COVID so the fact that my whole family was there and my son, that is what really tipped it and it was on my son's third birthday. That's what made it crazy great.